Hey, Warriors, welcome back. Well, it's finally here, the $100 challenge, hosted by Sabs Rehabs. The challenge is to see if we can make over a piece of furniture for $100 or less. And that's what we're going to attempt to do today. Don't forget, if you haven't been there already, we have a playlist linked for you down in the description. So you can see all the other YouTube makeover artists that are participating. It's going to be a fun time. So let's get to it. In our last video, uh, you saw us doing a chest of drawers, which was made by Sumter. This is the matching dresser to it. We are not going to do it the same way. We are going to do it different than what we did the chest. But we picked this up free from Facebook Marketplace. So our starting cost today for the piece of furniture is going to be not a nil, zilch, n zero, <laughs> nothing. <laughs> Okay, we are using our power screwdriver to remove the hardware. Um, however, we are going to include in our total a regular screwdriver, which you can pick up at Dollar Tree. Okay, so we're going to use some Bondo to take care of some of these dents and things, and scratches. Most of the scratches that are on here will just sand out when we sand, but this won't. Okay, so a few of these bars, drawer glides have worked their way loose. So we're gonna go ahead and get some glue in here. The nails are still in them. So we can get them replaced where they were. Okay. 
Okay, so we're gonna sand all of this bundle off and give the rest of it a little scuff sand. And I'm using, let's see what we're using. This is a 120 grit. Okay, so we are going to get ready for hardware. These are going to be easy. We're 25, so 12 and a half is center. And we're at eight and a half, so four and a quarter is center. Hardware is three and a half on center. So three and a half is going to be one and three quarter.
we're going to take this whole unit and we're going to make it refunction by Laura. We're going to do seaside. Just like that. Isn't that a pretty color? Yeah. I still have to stir it first. We painted two coats on the entire unit, the dresser and the drawers. We're not going to bore you with all that painting. You already saw us do the first coat. So we're just going to skip toward the end of the painting uh, where we show you how much paint we have left and how we actually figured it out, um, what to price the paint at for you guys. Okay gang, so we just wanted to show you something real quick. We, um, because we're painting all the time, we buy all of our paints in quartz. However, you do not need to buy a quart to paint even a fairly decent sized dresser like this. Okay, so if you look, we are... Hold it this way. We're still up to here, inside here. Okay, so you can see that we haven't even used a half of this quart. So you can get away with buying, this is a 32 ounce, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, this is a 32 ounce. So you get away with buying a 16 ounce, so that's what we're gonna show on our pricing, is a 16 ounce container of this paint, because like I said, we're still up to here even after painting this. And even with a 16 ounce, you'd have paint left over. Okay guys, we're gonna finish putting the hardware on and we'll stage it and we'll show you what we got. We're gonna start with some pictures of what we started with. And by the way, we have merch. So if you're interested in some t-shirts, we have these up on our website now, links in the description. And use the code FLIPPERS20, you get 20% off our merch. We're gonna be adding new stuff all the time. So check that out. Next drawer.
And let's go ahead and take a look at what we started with. Challenge completed. With a final total of $88.98, we turn this old, ready-for-the-dump dresser into something that'll last somebody for a lot of years and looks good. Let us know what you think in the comments, and don't forget to check out all the other furniture makeovers in the playlist that's in the description. And once again, we'd like to thank Sab over at Sab's Rehabs. We appreciate all of you, and as always, have a flippin' awesome day.